You reminded me so much of E.T. Amazing. Love that. E.T. Phone home. While E.T. is the story of a boy and an alien, Bumblebee is the story of a girl and a car. Although she soon realizes this is no ordinary yellow VW bug. Bumblebee tells the backstory of its title character, a lieutenant to Optimus Prime in the Transformers movies. But rather than a massive macho action flick like the other films in this franchise, Bumblebee is more in the vein of 1980s coming of age stories. Oh, I'm, I'm good. I'm good, thanks. So there's something about this movie that made me think about E.T. It's amazing you say that because here we have alien life form coming down and people connecting with someone who's misunderstood and then finding friendship as a common goal. It does have that theme to it. Right. And I think in E.T. as well as in Bumblebee, you felt for E.T., you feel for Bumblebee. How do you think that works in the movie, Angela, that we just feel so much from these robots? <sighs> I don't know how they managed to get so much emotion out of it. But, I mean, there's been a history of it, you know, whether it's E.T., E.T., well, this is what I've been home. saying. Yes, I've been saying E.T. E. all day yeah. long. So there just must be something about them being afraid of us, we being afraid of them, of the not knowing, and then we, we meet, we connect. We realize that we want the same things. We're more alike than unalike, and, and we start protecting one another and becoming protective. Don't run! Do not run! She ran.